that one there with the girl in there. We're going to work on this one. This is designer and we're going to cut out the circle and put the image of the girl behind it. You can see I've got two layers there. So let's go back and start with a new one. Just a new document here. It doesn't matter what size it is. Device will do nicely. And we'll do that in, land, in portrait mode and transparent background. That's easy. So we'll just set that up and here it comes. I'll reduce that in size a little bit so we can see the entire thing. Now the first thing we've got to do here is put a rectangle of white, a white background over the entire um, document. So we'll just colour that, drag that out. It's a slightly grey colour so you can see it's different from the absolute background that shows up there. Now we've got that layer there and the next thing we've got to do is put a um, we're going to put a circle on there because we want it you can put any shape you like but we'll use the circle or ellipse as they like to say and you can drag that circle out hold your finger on the canvas if you want a perfect circle not really worried about that here at the moment now I'll position that circle right in the center it's a bit of a fiddle around there, but there we are, we've got it. You can see the crosshairs show you when it's right in the middle. Now, you can see there we've got a circle and a rectangle. Now, what we've got to do is go up to the top and select Subtract from the menu there. And you can see if you look closely that that cuts out the circle. That's, that's actually a transparent background. You're looking right through to the transparent background. You can see in the layers we've got it there, it becomes a mask. Now the next thing we do with that, it's that simple to cut out a circle or shape. The next thing we're going to put in an image of a girl behind that. Put anything you like of course, just that girl is easy to spell and there it is. Select any one of the images, there's a nice bright one in yellow. Let's drag that onto the canvas. You put it on there and you think, oh my god it's overwritten the whole thing but that's easy get the stock images out the way you can see it there now take hold of outside the circle the image and drag it down so you can just see the bit you want focused in the circle now take the mask and drag it up so it's the blue line is halfway inside the top one let it go and there's your uh, image in the circle now, how cool is that? That's very nice. And that's all there is to it. There they are in the um, layers panel. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There's lots of these little things come up.